Welcome to the presentation of Content and Process Management with UVIS. In this brief presentation, I will demonstrate a very simple document approval workflow. I will start by adding a document to the system, which will trigger the workflow. I will do this with a simple drag and drop capability of the system. However, we possess multi-channel import capabilities. Obviously, this process can be started by an email it can be started with an import from an MFP or with some batch import on the server side. I will just give this document a title. And I will give it a type. I assign it a type of contract management document and I will file the document. I can inspect the content and metadata of a document and I can start a very simple document approval workflow. I can assign an approver. I will assign myself to be an approver so that all documents and requests will be sent to me just to save time in this demonstration. I can enter a note. And I can start the workflow. If I now switch to dashboard and go to my inbox with unread messages, I will see that there is a new unread message. There are nine now. And if I select it and accept it, I can see that I have a message to check the contract. I can do this. And I see that the signature is missing. So I can answer to my colleague, the signature is missing, please request. And I can send this task back to the colleague who sent it. Because I sent the request to myself. Obviously, uh, in a second, there will be a new item in my inbox. And if I refresh, there it is. I can accept this task. I can see that the colleague has said that the signature is missing. Oh, sorry, I forgot about the signature. So I'm just going to replace the document with a new one, which now has a signature. And I say, sorry, done. I can answer it. And if I wait a second, then the new step is going to be here. I can accept it. I can see that the colleague has signed. I can verify it here. And I say, perfect. Thanks. And I approve the contract. And in a moment, the colleague who initiated this document approval workflow will also be notified that the document has been approved. I can also see the whole history of the process in this view. And now I can finish and terminate the process. Let us briefly see how this workflow is being modeled. You can see our designer. This is our modeling tool with which you can, among other things, model workflows. And you see our document approval workflow, which is basically a loop in which two activities can happen, document review and a question, which we call the query. And these two can happen as many times as you like. And the exit loop condition is either approved or rejected. And the user is being informed at this point. It is very easily extensible. So we can put a new work item here if we want. And we can give it a name. Inform CTO. And we can say that at the moment that document has been imported in the system, the CTO will be informed. This was a very brief demonstration of our process and content optimization capabilities with UVIS. Thanks a lot.